So are you sure you want me to hit your car with a sledgehammer? Yeah, go for cool, it. Oh, gotcha. Big Bruce! Yo, watch my bag! What the so, I, um... I definitely have some explaining to do. And no, I'm not parting out my car. I already got some offers for my fenders last night, which there's no way I'm selling these fenders, especially after you guys signed them. But if you guys follow my Instagram, which if you guys don't already, what are you guys waiting for? Go ahead and follow me on Instagram. I posted on my story that I tore up my whole car. We got the hood, the rear bumper, the front bumper, the wheels, and the two fenders completely off of the car. The car looks so empty right now. I wasn't supposed to start all this last night. I was going to start everything today once everybody comes over, but I got way too excited last night. I wanted to get a little ahead of the game for once. Usually we're always running late on everything, but to be completely honest, we're probably going to end up running out of time today with this. And that's a problem because all this has to be back on the car today. There literally is no option. We have to finish everything by today because tomorrow there's a show that I have to go to and there's no way you can show up to a show with all these pieces missing. And today we're also going to have fun with, uh, this bad boy. If you guys watched the last video, you guys know that this frame is causing some major issues. And today we're going to fix that issue. Sledgehammer meet frame frame meet sledgehammer also decided to get some satin clear paint i think all i'm gonna do is just spray paint all this blue gloss black but yeah i don't think that i'm gonna be putting the rear bumper on today the wing is definitely coming back though so many of you guys have been asking me to put the wing back on i get so many messages every day you guys seem to love the wing as much as i do the only reason why i took it off was just to change it up a little bit but huge mistake i miss the wing so much today we're not only just putting the wing back on we're also going to be adding something to the wing it's nothing major just something little but something little to add a little bit of flavor to the wing So are you sure you want me to hit your car with a sledgehammer? Yeah, go for cool, it. Cool, gotcha. For my fellow car enthusiasts, I do not condone this at all. Please do not do this stupidity. He is one of a kind, he's a professional idiot. <laughs> do not do this, please. So we're making some pretty good progress. The frame is completely just smushed. We have to do the back a little bit more. It's a little tricky because I don't want to hit the bag and I don't want to hit the brakes, but I also don't want to disassemble my whole suspension again. So we just have to, I just have to work on this a little bit more. Same thing on the other side. Like I said, there is no time limit, but all this has to get done by today because tomorrow we have a show. We're gonna run to the store real quick, get some masking tape to mask all this off so we can spray paint all this black. Without a doubt, I can say the car is getting super haggard up today, but hopefully by the end of the day, it should look a lot better. Again, this is not permanent. I'm Please. gonna be spray paint. What do you mean not what? permanent? No, I mean I'm not gonna leave it like this. Oh, <laughs> this isn't permanent, so we are gonna put the rear bumper on again eventually. I have to make some adjustments to the rear bumper. I wanna fix up these holes and respray the bottom diffuser, or maybe even get a different diffuser before I put it back on the car. That's why right now we're just gonna keep it black and the wing is going back on. I'm so excited for the wing to go on, you guys don't even know. In the comments, put one for wing and two for no wing. I guarantee you there'll be more no wings than wings. No. Nah. so much better without the wing. Hell no, dude. It definitely looks better with the wing. It, all right. It gives it personality with the wing. It says that he was banging his feathers with a sledgehammer. So I could go lower. 
What do you mean? We are really starting to run out of sunlight. I told you guys already, no matter how early I start for some reason, we always really cut close to time. Just laid down the second coat of black and I'm only gonna do two coats. I'm also gonna do one coat of clear. It's looking really good. You thought this was gonna be a hack job, but what did you say about it? Even you liked it. Honestly, it came out really, I'm, I'm really jealous. I feel like we could do more <laughs> stuff to my car. We, we can. Look at Vin. Broken. Vin's working hard editing his video. <laughs> give him give him a sub, guys. Let's go <laughs> give trying, him a sub. I'm, I'm going to put the wheels back on the car, air it out, and see how it sits. Hopefully, it's good. I really don't want to go back and bang it. It was really fun when we first started, but it's just starting to hurt now. If any of you guys have done this before, you guys know that after a while, your like hands start cramping up, and it just it hurts so bad. Does it look lower? I don't know if it's like because there's no hood, but I feel like the headlight was never like below my knee. You know what I mean? All right, air out. It, it, it. <laughs> <laughs> that's not that's not even my splitter. My splitter goes underneath that. Yeah, oh, 100%. I am touching 100%. the ground. <laughs> Dude! I'm sweating. I look nasty. Probably look disgusting. Vin, Vin looks better than me. Let me show you guys Vin. <laughs> Uh, Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> but dude, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I can't wait to put the bumper on. It actually worked. And I know people on the internet are going to roast me about doing this. People are going to hate me for doing this. But it worked. At the end of the day, it worked. I would hope all it be lower. We just banged the fuck out. <laughs> oh, boss. We just banged the fuck out of your car. <laughs> I'm looking at the wing right now. Just looking at it with the car makes me so happy. I missed it. I'm not gonna show you guys just yet. I said I got something new for the wing. I'm gonna put that on and then show you guys. I've actually had these for like a while now. I think it's been like two months and I still haven't put them in, but then again, the wing wasn't even on the car. But uh, I think tomorrow is a great time to break them out. If you guys have ever seen my wing in person, you guys probably know that it is cracked in a few places, especially because Everybody, I mean like everybody at shows just walks right into my wing and hits it. If any of my bros live in like the central Jersey area or even in Jersey in general and know where I can get my carbon fiber wing redone, definitely let me know because I want to get it redone so bad. The one and only thing I don't like about this is that it's not carbon fiber. Now I can get over that. It's really hard to see because it's so dark, but this isn't carbon fiber. This is this is a regular uh, black aluminum plate. My wing, as you guys know, is carbon fiber. It's really dirty, but it came with carbon fiber end plates. Now the new end plates are more aggressive and they're not carbon fiber, but honestly, I can... <laughs> honestly, I don't really care. I'm kind of over these. Damn, this is so much more aggressive, hanging so much lower. Damn, that's just, that's just a good wing right there. Holy shit. This car is looking so aggressive. I love days like these where like I pull the car apart and then put it back together and I like slowly start to fall in love with it again. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. Some of you guys might know what I'm talking about, but I'm just like, I'm putting the car back together slowly and I'm just loving it more and more. It's so weird, but it's satisfying. Now with the back end done, let's go ahead and start on the front. I'm gonna air up the car, slap on the fenders and everything. I'm gonna put the camera down. Hurry up, get everything back together, and uh, I'll check in with you guys once the car is back together. Eventually. It's been an adventure with this car today, to say the least. I'm just loving how everything came out now. It's absolutely filthy. Just, oh God, that's, ugh, that is nasty. I have to leave my house for the show around 7.30 a.m., so. I'm gonna have to wake up pretty early to wash this thing. I can't even fit my key under the bumper. 
That is awesome. The wing is back on the car. The rear bumper is not. Like I said, there are a bunch of reasons why I didn't put the rear bumper back on, which you guys will see in the upcoming videos. And before I end this video, I just want to say that I know that I'm going to get a lot of hate for banging my frame. A lot of people aren't going to understand why I did it. A lot of people are going to understand why I did it, but totally disagree with me. That's fine. I always knew this little trick, but I always avoided doing it. I just didn't feel comfortable enough doing it. But I got to that point where I was just like, let's fucking send it. I'm going to do it. And so far, I don't regret it at all. I really hope it doesn't give me any problems in the future. Future, but uh, I'm way too tired right now. I'm gonna get some sleep. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.